day the announcement we've all been waiting for came out and we effectively saw the unblinded results of the long hauler study with loronlimab being the drug versus placebo and when you look at the 24 clinical measurements that are preliminary reported on it looks like the treatment group had a positive response meaning they either got better or didn't get worse in 18 of the 24 categories and this is i think pretty impressive obviously the next step is to really look at each entity each symptom and really try and determine are there some symptoms that are more responsive than others to really statistically see if there's any outcome you can measure which is difficult because this is a small group of patients and traditionally or statistically with small groups of patients it's hard to get a clean comparison with numbers you need a certain n or a certain a number of patients to be able to really do a comparison but i'm hoping nevertheless that for each symptom there will be a p-value that could be calculated and ultimately the most important thing is to match this up with the biomarkers and then to plan ahead with the fda for a larger study which was always anticipated going to be necessary and this next study will be comparing dosages because there still is a lot of information we need to find out about what's the appropriate dose for each patient do all patients need the same dose what is the time frame and the number of dosages that a patient needs to receive to be able to get over their symptoms so still a tremendous amount of work needs to be done but i think without the results from today's release there is no ways that one could move forward. So I'm very, very encouraged that we see so many people showing improvement in so many of their symptoms. And I'm just hoping this is the start of a fast move towards the next study when we'll move forward. From my perspective today, uh, mixed feelings, always good to tell patients that they were on drug and that they did better and to hear them tell you they feel better. And for those patients who want placebo, really just trying to reassure them that we're still there for them and hopefully that uh, when they're in the next study and get drug that they will improve to the same extent of the results we've seen and once more i want to just thank all the patients who participated in the study it was very time consuming and arduous to come in weekly for almost three months we really appreciate it and hopefully we can get them into the next study if they were on placebo.